One of the most exciting things about System.io is that on one page, you can have multiple pop-ups and utilize them in different buttons, okay? And the main reason why that's exciting is because if you're like me and you have multiple courses, you can set up each individual button to open a specific pop-up for that specific course, redirect him to a specific page, sent them to specific automations and everything on one page. So every single one that lands on this page and they select whatever button they fit, okay, they are going to enter your automations just like that. They don't need second pages, third pages, etc. It's everything in one place. So I want to share with you exactly how I build this and the steps behind it to make sure that you have a good user experience. Ready? So the first thing I said is I build a design just like this and then I set up all the buttons right there to make sure that I start the process, okay? So go ahead, design your pages and uh, when you have it done, then let's go ahead and proceed to the next part. Now, once you have the design, you want to make sure that you click on the button and you want to understand that the way that these buttons show pop-ups is by going to action when button clicked and click on show pop-up and then on the pop-up you need to share or click the specific pop-up that you want to show okay now probably you don't have any pop-up right here so that's the step three the two okay the second step is going to pop-ups and creating as many pop-ups as you like so go ahead add pop-up design the pop-up um, add the information all that stuff if you want inspiration you can pause the video here and get inspiration from this specific pop-up okay go ahead do that once it's done we go to step number three now for the step number three after the pop-up is selected okay so we go ahead pop-up number four we go to the button show pop-up pop-up number four that's all you need to do that's step three got it let's go ahead and do step number four so when we do this, this pop-up, you're going to show the pop-up number four. You're going to show when we click here. So now what we need to do is set up the automation of the pop-up. So right now we get my free course. We click on this button and now we need to make sure that this is correct. So what we do is you submit form first because we are submitting the email addresses. Then we want to redirect them to a specific page that is going to be you know, the thank you page, for example, for the other page, for the other, for this specific one, for this specific course, and you add them right there. Okay. So in this case, I have this page here and I'm going to paste it there. And there we go. This is the thank you page for getting access to the funnels theory course. That's it. Okay. The next thing is we want to make sure that we start the automation so they actually get access to the course. Okay. Again, this is a free course. There's not a paid course, but you can also do this for a paid page. Okay, now we're going to go ahead and do that. So how we do it is we add automation. And now here you should have everything blank, right? Just like this. So you're going to go ahead and add an action, add a tag. Then you go ahead and choose the tag. In my case, it's Funnels Theory. And I'm going to go ahead and save the rule. Now, every single time that they in, um, import or they add the email addresses here, they are going to go ahead and get tagged with this tag. The second thing is we're going to go ahead and enroll on a course so this is it the next thing is we need to select the specific course in my case it's funnels theory i have full access not trip content just full access and there we go save the rule once it's done we're going to go ahead and hit save now that you have all these steps let's go ahead for one last step and the last step in making sure that we have the pop-up button the edit settings by clicking on the edit settings we have the pop-up button this way show close button on choose the color that is a good contrast with your color of the pop-up open pop-up up automatically off and open on exit off this is going to make sure that you have a good usability and user experience here. okay so now let's go ahead and hit save once we do this we preview we go back here we have a pop-up here that is showing automatically so we need to remove it let's go to the pop-up we have this pop-up number eight we just remove this pop-up number eight because i don't need it i'm going to go save and preview so now there's no other pop-up showing up good usability we click here there's all this information we add the information and click then voila they go to the specific page that we wanted 